Hello, everybody. This is Stan and Mary's putting the putting the recorder on. Uh, it's a Wednesday night. Normally, about you know thirty to forty people would be here, and we'd be doing our regular class. However, since we're not able to, we're going to do this live. Uh, Tango and salsa. Tango and salsa. Um, and hopefully, we'll get back soon. I'm not going to shave till we do. So anyway, <laughs> there you go. So uh, we're going to start with tango, and I'm going to go over the first part a little quicker. I'll, I'll talk about it, and then I'm going to go over the next part. This is going to be for the Muni, the tango. If we don't use it for the Muni, which I'm sure by June 18th, that'll be three 19th. months, 19th, mm -hmm. hopefully we'll be able to do stuff like that, especially since it's an outdoor event. Anyway, back to the tango. We're going to be starting in promenade, and there'll be people coming on the other side. That's what I envision, but until I get a bunch of you guys here, I don't know. Tango. So we're in promenade. We're closed up. Our, finger, our hands are there. Our elbows are out. Our toes are going in the direction. Toes are going in the direction. Our hand is down lower in tango. She's sitting back in my arm a little further. And we keep bent. So we're going to start with the promenade. Slow, slow. We do quick, quick, and just open on slow. I don't want any of the leg for the man. Okay? We're going to open up the arm. We're still very flexed. Our leather leg is a little straighter. We're going to do quick, quick, slow. We're going to do side together. She's also going to do a turn. Side together. We're going to have this nice little one. We're going to go ahead and look down. We are going to step slow while she does quick, quick to bring her in. Quick, quick. That was our slow. Now we're going to get her hand and go quick, quick. Look and stand up and wait. Yes? Now this will be the new part that we haven't done. I'm going to put my hand on top instead of down. I'm going to put it on top. Of the wrist and when we do this part we are going to start a curving walk slow slow now we're going to do a lot of contra body here quick quick now on this next one she's going to do a scoop kick scoop and we just step that's all so we're gonna do that again I don't want to get too fast we'll repeat a couple times and hopefully you guys will be able to get that so this is what we did last week or this weekend, slow, we take another step, slow. All heel leads, by the way, quick, quick, slow, open up, quick, quick, side together, down, she does a turn, and then we're gonna do. And remember, ladies, you're gonna turn into the connection, so not over here. And also the so hands on the time. I'm turning into the connection of his hand. And we're both flexing to get that nice little elasticity we're gonna create for this next part. She does quick, quick, I do slow, quick, quick, I get her in the hand, Quick, quick, slow, slow, we stand up. Now here's our curving walk. We'll start right away, slow, slow, we curve. Quick, quick, now here's her scoop kick. She's gonna push like she has paper on that foot and she's scooping it up, bending her knee. Quick, quick, and that's a slow. After that, we're going to rotate and do another quick, quick, slow on the other side. Quick, quick, with a lot of rotation, a lot of contrary, slow. Guys, you don't do anything. After that, we're gonna do two slows. One, two, and she does quick, quick, slow. Stepping on everything. Now we are facing the line of dance, being this way. But there's gonna be other people on the other side facing us. We're gonna back up. We're gonna do it just from the shadow this time. So we're in shadow. My hand now is somewhere about where her shoulder blade is. I'm going to take it around a little bit in our promenade or in our shadow position. So here, actually I was holding it here, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Here, we're going to walk. This is a lot of contra body, rotating slow. Thighs are still together, slow. Those are all heel leads. Everything entangles a heel lead. Continue to curve, slow. We're going to do a rocking step. Quick, quick. I step on the left foot, she scoops. I do not. We're both going to rotate a lot. This is where I think I want everyone to look at the audience. Like right here at the first one left and right at them. So quick, quick, she steps slow. She does three weight changes. Quick, quick, slow, we do slow, slow. Quick, quick, slow. And I did slow, slow. The next thing we're gonna put a little pasta doble step in. And that is going to be a flamenco but without the taps. So we're gonna do forward, side up to fall away. Arm goes up and this is the one time your hands get to turn in, not out, because you're in that position. This is a press line. So we're pressing down, 
and then we're gonna go on, do it on the other side, forward, side, back, and I'm gonna repeat that. We're only gonna do it once, but I'm gonna repeat what we just did. We were out here. Now, when we do this, we're stepping forward, side, I'm taking her hand. We're going to go up and press. There's our little press on. So our heels are off the ground in the front. We're gonna do it on the other side, quick, quick, slow. Okay, and we're gonna go from the top. So this is the beginning again from what we did on Saturday or Sunday. Everyone's starting in promenade when the music starts, and all heel leads everyone. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. Guys are on the right, girls are on the left. Step together, side. Guys are on the left, girls are on the right. We're looking down, and I'm gonna do quick, 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 pick her up, quick, Quick, slow little lunge, stand up sharp. Curving walk, slow, slow, quick, quick, scoop, kick, quick, quick, scoop, kick. I'm gonna let her go. I do slow, slow, she did quick, quick, slow. This is our flamingo part. Forward, step, up, and forward, side, back. And then we'll do further, next time. I don't want to get too uh, overwhelmed. I'm going to give you the timing now. So I won't stop this time. I'm just going to call up the timing. Guys timing first, which is almost like the girls except for a couple different parts. And slow, slow, quick, quick, hold slow. Quick, quick, slow. Slow, quick, quick, slow, 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 quick, Quick, slow, and quick, quick, slow, slow, slow. Quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. And then we'll come out somehow, I'm not sure how yet, but something. And then we'll go on in a circle. Ladies part, and then we'll go to a different place. Don't do that. All right, ladies time. Slightly different in a couple places only. And slow, slow. Quick, quick, and slow. She does that little tap thing, so short of the tap. And slow. Guys, don't do that. And then she does the same thing. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, 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 slow, slow. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow. 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 And then we'll come up. Okay, there's the tango. Now it's salsa time. I'm gonna do the salsa we've been doing, but I'm gonna put a lot of technique I'm on it. I'm gonna check and see if we have any questions while you're talking about that. Okay. Didn't see any. It's running on my PC too. Okay, keep talking, it's okay, live. Okay, so, um, one thing about the salsa compared to other Latin dances, it definitely steps on a bent knee no matter what you're doing. There is no American or international style to this. Bent knee. So when we step, we step on a bent knee, the other one's straight and we switch and we switch. So it's always stepping on a bent knee. One thing I want you guys to try to remember, a lot of us have done West Coast, but it doesn't have to be a West Coast thing. Sometimes people will go back, it should be a rock and we play a step, but they'll do like a coaster step, quick, quick, slow. And it should not be that, it should just be rock, step, step. So those are a couple little, uh, little, Technique parts. The other thing is we're gonna talk, when I have Mary, I'm gonna talk about turnout. Always turn out, but never sickling the foot in. I wanna be big, like if I'm stepping with my right foot, but I wanna make sure that this is turned out and that is definitely turned out. I don't wanna pigeon my toe, meaning sickling or turning it in. And I don't wanna overstep where I'm supposed to be. We have a question. Um, Shannon Jackson asked, does the foot pass all the way through the knee at the passe? and through the, I think she's saying releve, but I can't tell. It definitely passes. When I do the passe part, I guess you're talking about the passe doble? Uh, I think she's talking about the flick. Oh, the flick. In the passe, yeah. Oh, so that's a term that Mary knew. So mm -hmm. it must be a ballet term, but it, it, it does pass. I think that's what you're asking. Yeah, so if we're going, if we're going so slow, her. slow, we go quick, Quick. This is going to do um, a pot of, uh, pot of shawl. So step of the scoop horse. Kick. It's a scoop kick. You're going to 
push that piece of paper through and then come up through passe. Then immediately the gentleman is going to shape me to the right. So then I turn my body and I put it down and I do my rock with my heel with lead um, on my right foot. And then I do the same thing with my left foot. I push that piece of paper, I scoop up into the passe. And then when he turns me, I step out again with a heel and then I come out of it. So uh, from the back? Okay. Sometimes it's easier to see from the back. Okay, so I'm here. We're doing left foot slow. Slow. We're going to rock. Or is it quick, quick, right? Oh, you're right. Okay. Quick, quick. I push that piece of paper. Slow and. Quick, quick, slow and. Quick, quick, slow. Okay, so I hope that answers your question. Thank you for asking, Shannon. Let me see if there's any other questions while Stan goes on. Well, I need you. Okay, we'll keep talking. I'm just checking. Okay. We're good. Okay, so since we have people on both sides, and we are going to do the salsa for the muni, by the way. If we don't end up doing it at uh, Swing at the Capitol, which I hope we will, but if we don't, I'm going to start off with a crossover only because some people are facing this direction and some of the gentlemen are facing this direction. So we're going to start on our right foot because our first step for the crossover is our left. Her first step is her right. So we're going to show turnout. So we're all going to step through and have turnout. Now notice Mary's foot is even more turned out than mine. It doesn't have to be that turned out, but it's good. But you don't want to simple. So we're going to open up as much as we can to start. We're both on a bent knee. Our back leg is straight. We're going to switch. Our back leg is now bent, our front leg is straight, and we're going to step side, and we're going to keep this open. Because our next step, and again, we're on a bent knee here. Our next step, we're going to go through really quickly, sharply, and do forward, side, straight back, and then we do a rock, step, and you know this one, guys, quick, quick, slow, side, together, side. Now I'm going to go a little faster and come back, because there's some technique that I really want everyone to do. First one, right here. Quick quick, slow. Right now, I'm releasing. This is my middle finger and my thumb. This is my middle finger and thumb on this side. So, the hands are this way. They're both in the same direction, going towards the back of the audience. When she turns, I go very loose, quick, quick, slow, and I keep it that direction. Very, very easy for her to follow, and it doesn't twist up. Ladies, you don't want to grab the guy's fingers either. So again, we do the rock back, rock, step, step. She turns quick, quick, slow, and I don't move much. I don't want to pull her off. Okay, that makes sense? Here, what we can use is the rock, step, side. I have to get out of the way, not going too big, neither is she, and I'm gonna follow her around. Quick, now I'm gonna go very slow. This left hand comes up, which is not a cross hand hold, but her, that means her right hand. Quick, the right fingertips and the hand stays on her shoulder, slow. Now she's going to rock and I'm going to rock. Quick, quick, slow. Here, what I have to make sure the guys do, quick, quick, slow, is let go of this right hand, especially once she starts turning. I just let go. Quick, quick, follow her. All ladies are going to do this differently. Some are going to be very tight. Some are going to be a little bit further. Guys, it's up to you to follow them. So I'm going to do that step again. Because this one, right here, rock, step, step. Again, my hands are here. She palms are up. She's not closing in on me. You know, sometimes ladies will have a vice grip there. And guys will do the same. Very light. I do rock, step, very small rocking steps. That way I can stay with her. If I rock too big, which I'll show you, I'm going to throw her off. Sorry. But again, I don't want to rock. Ladies, you don't want to either because the same thing can happen. So rock, step, step, rock, step, very loose, rock, step, step. Now, when she turns here... I still have fingertip, thumb and middle finger. I am not holding on my hand. She is very, very arthritis type hands, very loosely holding me. I and don't now. Have but then we're, <laughs> we're gonna rotate. We do a back step forward, back step forward. We rotate, we're all both looking in that direction. Rock step. I'm probably gonna bring my feet together, depending on what the girl does. And now I'm just gonna chop, 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 staying with her. Then my next step, I wanna really, really step straight forward. I do not want to curve this. To make it look better, I step straight at the girl, very small. One, 
I, my hand changes here, I step in this direction, completely to the side, okay? She should do the same. Right at me, quick, and then quick, slow, to the side. Now I still have that same kind of hand look. Very, very loosey-goosey. This is where people get in trouble when they do combs and, and pretzel type stuff. Very loose, guys. Because a, a lot of times the girls will grab, and the guys might too. This goes over her head, quick, quick, slow. As I do that, I grab her left hand, same thing. Very loosey-goosey, middle finger and thumb. This is behind her head. She starts to turn. I do the same rotation, only I'm gonna rotate even more. Quick, quick. I let go, but now I find her. Quick, quick, slow. I found where she's at. Ladies, this is very important for you. As you do this, I put this over my head. This is a progressing step. It does not come together, and you do have to get around. Rock, step, it progresses. Now she's in front of me. A lot of ladies don't want to get in front of the guy, or they don't, I'm not saying they don't want to, they don't. So if they move back and do that coaster step, they're not gonna make it. Or if they just kind of step in place. Or if they don't get around. They need to rock, step, step. This is what makes the next part super easy. So I'm gonna do that part, because this is an important part. And a hard part. So this goes over again. Rock, step, step. My hand is finding her. Rock, step, step. Guys, you just follow. Now, gentlemen, you have to do rock, step. Don't go too far. You didn't pass. There you go. And then we're to the side. Now, our next part, we have to maintain frame. Her and, and me. So I barely go to my right side. She steps. I counterbalance her. She comes back. She steps. I counterbalance her. Ladies, when you step swivels, if it's not too fast, you want to go straight leg, pretty much. So guy steps side. He's bent knee, though. Guy steps side. Now, I've already, she's creating a connection with me of very much elasticity. This is very small for the man. She goes all the way around. Guys, you just do rock. You step. She's coming around. I haven't moved. Now my first movement is to the side. And notice Mary is twisted. Uh, something. My left leg went behind. So right. it hooks behind. It does hook behind. You can't see her. But she's very twisted, which I haven't been talking about because I didn't realize it twisted that much, but it, it, it's nice. You will get much more out of this if you're twisted. So when I do this again, when I pick her up, gentlemen, rock, step, bring her to the side. Don't step big, guys. She needs to step past you slightly here as you go here. Slow. And we go back here. Slow. This is created. Guys, your footwork is back in place side. And ladies, your footwork was, as he does that, quick, quick, slow. I'll do the two swivel, swivels again. Swivel, swivel. Yours is going around and him. And the ladies want to think step and, step and, because yes. I'm, I'm here, I go step and, step and, or slow and, slow and. Yeah, and that always gives you your speed. Your ands are always your motion, your ands are always your swivel. So then, lady step is forward, side, back. Now, here's what I was talking about, the twist. Mary's getting a twist, so I'm gonna do the first one a little fast so you can see it, and then I'll slow it down. I do a, this is called a surprise, I do a check. She does a side leg, quick, quick, slow. So it has a lot of speed that I didn't have to like force it, it just happened because of where she was at. Now I'm gonna go slower. So I'm on my right foot, she's, she's got comfort right here. Now she's gonna open, her right hip up, boom. That's what's gonna create a lot of that speed. Gentlemen, when we're here, we actually check toward her. If we check away, it's gonna be very hard, sorry. That's right. <laughs> but it's gonna be hard, because if I check away, she can't do what she wants. We have to work as, as a team. So she's behind again, her foot's behind, she's twisted. I check toward her, that leaves me to where I haven't pulled her off her balance. Now, because I'm here, and I'm rotating a lot, and I'm gonna step back, that's going to step her into the next part. That's the surprise. Quick, quick, slow is the surprise. And then this next part is a crossbody lead. Quick, quick, slow. This is, I think, where we do the taps. So our arms are down. We're going to pick our knees up and we're going to point across. We're going to pick our knees up and we're going to step small. Gentlemen, you don't want to go too far. We do a full basic, rock, step, step, right here. Where her hands are in the middle, I'm going to release, and I'm going to go back. Open break. Open break. Anytime you do an open break, no matter what dance you're doing, it's left foot for the man, right foot for the lady. Always, that's an open break. Doesn't mean there can't be other breaks, but this is an open break. So we're here, quick, 
quick. She passes her feet again for the arm check. Always passing, rock, step, step. Guys, you're gonna walk through this, not pushing. You don't really need to. If you just put your hand here, you do a walk around turn and she does a three step turn or a Sinead turn. One, two, three. That's a walk around turn. So that's pretty, pretty basic there. Then I'm going to grab her right hand. She's opened up. We're going to step forward, small step again. Rock, step, side. This is nothing more than a cross body lead, but what makes this hard is to get the guy on that side and the girl on this side. So ladies, when you step, you're gonna think around the guy and he's gonna switch lanes if you go around you. Gentlemen, you have to go super small here. You go very, very tiny. Rock, that's your cross body lead. Step, now I step here. That made that easy to get to. Right hand to right hand, cross over, quick, quick in front of me. I only put my hand here so that the ladies are wanting to do something extra. I don't have to because Mary knows the step or most of you will know the step. This is a regular walk around as we rock back, walk, Go around, she steps forward. It's not big, that's perfect. Now, you do the same thing you do in a super row. She'll rotate, guys go forward out of her way, side, back like a jazz square, and basically that's it, because I'm just gonna rock, step, step. We'll do our basic, and then at the Muni, we will not be doing country. But if we do the other one, we will do country, and we will use that again. So, do we have any questions before I do the whole thing and talk about it? Because I'll talk about the bent knee, the, the elasticity. There's a few things with, um, with Mary that I did that I haven't been talking about, like the surprise with the extra twist. That will add power and speed. So you will get a lot of power and speed. Turn out, keeping bent knee, uh, always, always, always staying turned out, but never sickling the foot. So if girl or guy, don't sickle the foot, stand up. One bent, one straight, almost all the time. You'll never have two bent. Never have, you might have two straight for a second as it's coming through. But other than that. Uh, Jean and Liza are watching from Indiana. Oh, hi, Jean. Hi, <laughs> they, Liza. They, Long time no see. They say, miss you. We miss you, too. <laughs> uh, I don't think we have any other questions. Right, so I'm just going to okay. go over the whole salsa. And then I will just for fun go over the walls. Or maybe not. No, I, I probably won't do no, that. We'll just do the salsa tonight. So, from the beginning, I'll try to go a little bit faster. Timing the salsa is easy. Everything is quick, quick, slow. I haven't changed the timing. Guys and girls part, all the same. So, that was easy. Again, I'm starting here. Whether you started facing this way or you this way, you're here. So, as we open up, we all, I talk about foot swivel. So, our right foot is going to swivel. Her left foot's going to swivel. Before we ever step through, here's our foot swivel. And, quick quick and slow. The and is the swivel. We're going to go right on through. Our arms are out. We're going to face sharply. Foot swivel, quick, quick, straight back. Rock, step, step. We do side together. Side, she did a chenet turn. Here, my hands, palms are holding this direction, but as soon as I do the slow, quick, quick, I change the handhold. There's what I was talking about in the beginning. Pinchers, both sides are going the same direction because she's turning in the same direction. So, as she walks around, quick, quick, slow. I just rock. Here we do rock, step, step. I'm gonna rock back and do back. Step, follow her, stay with her, make it nice and easy, still fan her hold. Rock, step, step, follow her, quick, quick, slow. Then we do the guys walking around where I step exactly straight. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. Over her head, quick, quick. Slow. I'm going to do a cross body lead. Ladies, quick, quick, slow. This is where you have to get all the way around and step rock, step, get there. Swivel, guys, move slightly to the right. Don't do too much. Here's a little slingshot. Quick, quick, slow. Check, step, slow. She's going to come through. Quick, quick, slow. Point, point, and step. Rock, step, open. Rock, step, step. Quick, quick, slow. And shake hold, quick, quick. Very small, guys, you don't move at all. Just rotate, ladies get to the other side. Quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. And we'll go ahead and do both of those to music real quick. So, salsa first since we just did it. Alexa, wait, thank God I'm a country boy by Travis Collins. We will have this video 
show for Cultural Arts Center in Centralia and so we are doing it because it is a country theme we're doing it to country music but what Stan was saying was that we will also do this to a song for the Muni and for a showcase uh, definitely for showcase it'll be to more of a salsa song instead of a country song. All right so I'm gonna play a tango it's going we're doing we're mixing it in with cell block tango, where the guys do some and the girls do some. And I need to cut that music, so this is not the music we're going to be doing it to, but just so you get an idea to music, what it'll be like. See you soon for group. And privates. 